I just changed the batteries on my Delta Touch faucet and I get the blue light but no water. Hi, I'm Mike and I have 20 plus years of experience as a plumber. I'll be glad to assist you today. Did you turn the shutoffs off while you were changing the batteries? Were the batteries dead or was that an attempt to fix a different issue? No, I did not. Yes, the batteries were dead. If you disconnect the battery for 30 seconds then reconnect does it work then? That will reset it. How do I do that? I do not see how to do that. Are you there? Sorry for the delay. The battery pack disconnects like a 9 volt battery. I just did and did not worked. Are you there? Hi Mike. Yes sorry for the delay again. The email thing did not notify. Turn the faucet handle on then disconnect the battery pack. Turn the faucet off and then on after removing the pack. Does the faucet operate without the battery then? No. Any chance your lines are frozen? Are you in a cold climate? Do you have water to your dishwasher? There is water. The dishwasher is on right now and is working. No frozen line. Do you hear the valve click when you touch the faucet? Yes, I hear it. If you disconnect the sprayer from the hose, do you get water then? If still not then if you look under the faucet underneath you will see the solenoid valve that the wires are connected to. Check that the plug is pushed all the way in on the valve. It kind of looks like a headphone jack. Also there is a red wire with a clip that should be clipped on the threaded post way up under the faucet. It will be a stretch I am sure to check these out. I did check everything and every wire is properly connected, the plug is completely in. No water. Sorry this has gone on so long. I really wanted to be sure. The solenoid valve has failed and is not opening. The thing we did earlier when I had you remove the battery pack with the handle on should have changed it over to manually operate without the battery but he solenoid never opened. If you contact Delta they will send another valve under the lifetime warranty. Otherwise you could remove the solenoid and bypass it to have a functioning faucet until then. Okay. Thanks. You are very welcome. If you have a home improvement or appliance question and want to chat with an expert now visit justanswer.com slash YTHI.